I'm going to open it. What up, everybody? Uh, welcome back to 99. This is uh, Who the Dude. I have no idea what we did last time. I think we uh, completed a room or something like that. I don't remember, but doesn't matter. We're here now. I'm gonna. It's gonna go and come back to me. Damn, that's a loud sound. Oh, Seven. Hey, what... What is this place? So I remember now. It's so huge. And empty. Oh, there are beds everywhere. Maybe... Maybe an infirmary or something like that? Is this a hospital? The harsh scent in the air is reminiscent of antiseptic solution. So it still smells like a hospital. I think so. There are shelves in the center of the room with medicine and surgical tools. Hey, look there. The four doors at the end. Three, seven, eight. The left door says three. The second door is blank, but the third has a seven. And the rightmost door is eight. There's no doubt. They're numbered doors. <laughs> of course, if there's a number on them, they are numbered. That's how hey. it works. Why is that door between three and seven blank? Does that mean anything? No point worrying about it right now. Let's see if these will open first. Yeah, good idea. Yeah, of course it don't open, man. <sighs> yep, locked. Just like I thought. Naturally. After all, there are rules to the nonary game. And to allow these doors to open easily would violate those rules. Alright, Mr. Rules. Unless we can authenticate ourselves with the red, the numbered doors will... Whoa, whoa, check this out. Look at the red. There's nothing on it. Huh? Don't you remember the red back at the main staircase? If there wasn't anyone in it, it said vacant on the little screen, remember? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're right. But this one... There's nothing. Yeah, this one's broken. Right? You think it's broken? Only one way to find out. No, nope, nothing. How about the red on door seven? And door three? I didn't think all of them would be malfunctioning. Mm -hmm. What does it mean? They've got to be broken. Man, that bastard. I didn't think Zero was the kind of guy who'd screw around with something like this. Whoa, whoa, Zero's been prepared for everything so far, and you're saying he's gonna make a mistake now? Well, that's the only thing I can think of. This thing ain't working at all. Hmm. It seems as if some of the internal hardware has been removed. What? How so? Internal hardware? That is what I said. Take a look at the underside of this red. If you please. The bottom? Huh. There's a thin slot here. I think it's a slot for something. Uh, probably electronic. The other two reds are the same. Something's been removed from all three of them. I get it. So the reds aren't working because somebody pulled out their guts. Hmm. Who might that be? So I assume. But why? And who? I, I mean, it really doesn't make sense. I have no idea. Why on earth would I know something like that? Hmm. Oh, what now? Creepy as fuck. June! Oh, everybody's back. Maybe she took it. 
Ace, Santa, Clover, and, and Lotus. Guess everyone's here. What are you guys doing? Why are you... That's my line? Perhaps we should exchange information. And that's what we know. Well, this isn't good. If the red is inactive, we can't keep going. Sorry, I keep getting texts all the fucking time. Sorry about that. What about that big hallway? Maybe there's somewhere in there we might be able to go. No, there's nothing there. The five of us had a quick look. Yeah, we had a quick look as well, right? Uh, sucks. There are plenty more hospital rooms, but nothing else. You mean all those doors are for hospital rooms? Yes. There are a number of individual rooms in addition to this large one. There was a door at the end of the hallway, but it was locked. It had one of those solar system mark things on it. Oh yeah, we got a key, I think, right? Maybe we should go to the key place. It was the Jupiter symbol. Just a second, I got it right back. Gotta write back or otherwise they're not gonna leave me alone. So, just got told them to leave me alone. Sorry about that. Jupiter. I wonder what it means. While we're asking what things mean, uh, what's the deal with this room? I mean, I thought this was a cruise ship, but I can't imagine a cruise ship would have a hospital like this. Yeah, maybe, maybe it's a ship for sick people. Well, I figure it's probably a hospital ship. Chances are it's the Gigantic. What? The Gigantic? What is this Gigantic? Ah, whatever. The Gigantic. She was a sister ship to the Titanic, built in the early 20th century. Ooh, explosion. Ooh, creepy music. I love these moments. Actually, the Titanic had two sister ships, and they looked exactly the same. The Gigantic was said to be one of them. Hmm, no wonder it's sinking. <laughs> they intended to make her a passenger liner like the Titanic, but World War I began soon after the ship launched. The British Navy took her over and made her a hospital ship. All right. At some point during the war, the Gigantic was damaged by a German mine in the Aegean Sea. She ran aground afterwards, so she didn't end up sunk. What happened to her after that? One theory going around is that a man named Lord Gordain bought her. It seemed like he'd been one of the few to survive the Titanic sinking. What the fuck, man? Like, if you survived the Titanic sinking, would you buy another ship that looks like the ship that sank with you in it? That's fucking weird, but maybe this guy's zero. Yeah, but he would be like hundred years old or something. That trauma turned him into some kind of obsessive collector of all things related to the Titanic. Yeah, crazy dude. Soon enough, the guy wanted the Titanic itself. Which was impossible, of course. It's stuck at the bottom of the Atlantic Ocean. Yeah. But the Gigantic wasn't. And seeing as she was identical, 
So you're saying this Lord Gordain bought this ship? Lord Gordain, huh? And as you can see, the name is like in brackets. So this uh, is important. Yeah, at least I think I am. That's impossible. No way we're in some boat that's almost a hundred years old. Well, it fucking looks like it's hundred years old, so... Pipe down, just pay attention. What, that's it? Well, have you got any proof? Proof? Proof that this ship is really the gigantic. Well, uh... This ship's got stuff that's like the Titanic and a hospital ship. So, I just figured... Oh, for goodness. Don't tell me that's your only reason. Yeah, come on, what the fuck do you need more, man? Do you need, uh... The documents or what? Do you need that name on the ship outside? No, I I've got more! Like? Well, uh... I mean... I don't know. If the game's selling us, then it must be true. <sighs> I guess your memory isn't back yet, is it? Yeah, sorry about that. Yeah, stop smoking weed, bro. Two hours, right? Something. Oh, a bell. It sounds like the clock in the main stairway. 10, 11, 12. Huh, 12. It's midnight. Three hours. So it's been three hours, right? Then we've still got six hours left, right? Let's get going. We gotta find the missing parts for the Reds. Yeah, we gotta get the fuck out. What do you mean, find? How on earth do you propose we do that? We've looked everywhere in this room, but we haven't found anything. Right. Yeah, we got the keys, That right? only leaves one place to look. One? Uh, well, not just one. Uh-huh. Wait. Don't tell me you mean we need to search all of the other rooms. Well, you already checked some of them out before you came here, right? We each checked a single room, so five rooms in total. All right, then. That's five rooms we don't have to search. <sighs> we just have to split up the rest between the eight of us. If each of us can do six rooms apiece, we'll have the other 48 rooms cleared in no time. Hmm. There are 48 other rooms? Uh, just maybe? <sighs> How the fuck do you know? Very All right, suspicious. so everyone knows which area they're searching? Yeah. Yes! We'll all meet up when the clock goes off again. Ah, uh, how about in that room with all the beds? Hmm. Yeah, sounds straightforward enough. I'll shout if I find any of the components we need. I hope we can find them within the time limit. If we can't, then we'll just have to come up with another plan. Right. Then let's do this. Why not just search the, the place that we got the keys for? Maybe I'm wrong here, but whatever. It's one. I better get back to the others. So it took one hour to search for the... For everything. Huh? What are they doing over there? What happened, guys? Jumpy, look! Vacant? What the fuck? He just... <sighs> worked. Come on, guys. Who was it? I thought we were supposed to yell if we found it. Well... What the hell? What is up with you guys? Well, that's the thing. We don't know. You don't know? When I got back, it was already like this. There was no one else here. Very suspicious. That means I was the first one back, but... Mm, so the you're missing suspicious. parts were already back in the red. What? Let me see. You're right. It's in there. What about the other two? They're the same. Let me take a look. It's just as you said. All right, I, I just want to be sure here. Nobody has any idea what the hell happened here, right? Correct. None. So zero. <sighs> huh. Wait a minute. 
Where's Snake? Does that mean that he found them? I've no idea. There's nothing to suggest it. But nothing to suggest he didn't either. Oh shit, so you we were separate and someone's missing. I don't suppose we'll know until we can ask him in person. Well, whatever he did or didn't do, he's pretty damn late. What the hell is he up to? Yeah, maybe he fell down because he's blind. Maybe he's lost. Yeah, well, that seems likely. Dude can't see. I don't know how he gets around in the first place. No! That's impossible! Yeah, my brother's blind, but he's got really great hearing! He can get around as well as anyone who can see! Oh yeah, he's Daredevil. Uh, or a bat. So he... he couldn't get lost! That's impossible! <laughs> I'm gonna go look for him! What hey, uh, hold on, Clover! There, Wait! Well, that didn't work. Damn it. What should we do now? Well, the red is working now. No! We're not leaving two people behind! We should go look for them! Hmm. Oh man, this ain't good. Oh yes, what an excellent idea. We just wasted a bunch of time looking for some piece of electronic junk. Now let's waste some more by looking for a couple of idiots. Then remain here if you feel you must, but there's no time. We've only five hours left. Let's split up. All right, I'll take this direction. Then I shall look that way. I'll be over here. Let's see you all later. All right, we should go too. Mm, we better not split up yes, again. Yes, let's go. But where should we start? Let's see. Hmm. Let's see. We've been to get casino, right? How about the casino on B deck? Yeah, it's open because uh, seven left you open. Okay, last time. let's go, Jumpy. Let's have a look. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Isn't it obvious? I'm looking for Snake. I'm just not seeing it. Really? Maybe you need to look harder. I don't think that's the problem. Oh, by the way, I've got a proposal for you two. Care to hear it? Yeah. What is it? Well, I don't like to beat around the bush, so I'll get right to it. Why don't we team up? Team up? Yeah. What? You need me to explain it to you? I'm saying, why don't we go through a numbered door? Even if we wanted to, that's impossible. Why? Jumpy's bracelet number is five, mine is six, and yours is eight. Our digital root would be one. Hmm. So we need... We need a two, right? But there's no number one door in the large hospital room. We need a two or a seven. The only doors there are three, seven, and eight. Then we add another person. Huh? Who? What, isn't that easy? Seven. Oh, if we add seven. Five plus six plus eight plus seven equals 26. The digital root of 26, two plus six equals eight. Wait a minute. What about the other four? Ace, Snake, Santa, and Clover. Well, why don't you add them up? 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 and 1 plus 0 equals 1. The digital root for those four would be 1. That's right. And you know the number one door isn't in the big hospital room. Of course I know that. No! Are, are you saying you'd leave them behind? Mmm, uh, very shady, Lotus. Of course not. What kind of woman do you think I am? Yeah, my battery level is low. Nice, cheers. 
Once we get off the ship, we could come back and rescue them, couldn't we? Yeah, but by then the ship would have sunk. Then we wouldn't really be leaving them behind. Don't try to lie to us. I don't think you'd do anything of the sort. Really? Why do you think that? You remember, don't you? We have less than five hours left. Even if we manage to escape, there's no way we could come back to rescue them in less than five hours. Hmm. Well, you never know until you try. No, no, you're not thinking this through. Even if we brought Seven with us, we wouldn't be able to get off the ship. The four of us couldn't open door nine. It is, it is hidden, hidden, but an, an exit, exit can, can be found. Be found. Seek a way out. Seek a door that carries a nine. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. The digital route for the four of us would be eight, so we'd have to add ace to make nine. That's right. Unless we bring Ace too, we'll be. S oh, hmm. Well, that's unfortunate. Uh, but you're fucking shady. Unfortunate. That's all you have to say. Well, let's try and find another way, okay? A way to get out of here with all eight of us. That's impossible. Are you being serious? And you do know that only five people, at most, can go through one of the numbered doors, right? The number nine isn't going to be an exception to that rule. Regardless, at least three people will get left behind. Aww. Shit, what the fuck do you do now? Yeah, I I guess that makes sense. No. Wait just a second. You're skipping over a really big detail. Is that really okay? That means three people will die in the end. Are you okay with that? That's that's just Do you think I could have a moment alone? There are some things I need to think about. didn't turn out to be a very pleasant conversation. Yeah. Well, uh, regardless, let's just focus on finding Snake for now, okay? Yes, you're right. We can think about those other things later. Yeah. All right, where should we go next? So Lord is fucking shady. And she knows, like, now we know that three people have to die so we can escape, right? Yeah. I think if we had the ninth man, everything would be fine, but the dude had to go on and blow himself up like a lunatic. Let's go take a look at the first class cabin. It's really close. But yeah, so now we know two things. Lotus is shady as fuck. Three people might have to die here. And yeah, and Snake's fucking missing. Let's have a look. Plus, Lotus was the first one uh, uh, back in the big room when, when Snake went missing and the, the missing parts were uh, installed in the dead. So, let's, let's talk to Lover. Look, I know you're really worried, but, um... Alone. Alone. Hmm? Alone. Hmm? I said leave me alone! 
<laughs> what the fuck? You're so annoying! Just go away and leave me alone! Just go away, okay? Just go somewhere else! Stop bothering me! Uh, sorry, I I clicked too soon, but she, la she said, uh, Just looking at you guys is pissing me off. Uh, um... Why are you still here? Did you hear me? Yeah, I heard you. Huh? Fine, Let's get the fuck forget out. it. If you aren't gonna leave, then I'll just... Alright, let's go, June. Uh, yeah. She's fucking crazy. <sighs> we really need to find Snake, for Clover's sake. So, uh, where do you think we should go next? So we've been here, casino, the hallway. Hey, uh, why don't we go back to Sea Deck? We can take a look at that hallway with all the rooms. Yeah, and we are gonna do that next time when we play more uh, Zero Escape 999. Thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, things are getting really, really exciting. Like someone's missing. Like lots of stuff is happening really nice so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and come back for more soon because I got a couple days off and I have to oh my my stomach is uh <laughs> I'm really hungry right now so I'm gonna make some food then I'm gonna come back right away and play some more so thank you guys see you peace